What's up outsiders? I wanted to quickly tell you why I made this video, tell you about some issues I ran into with this video, and let you know exactly what you'll be watching today. Okay, first, why did I make this video? Two reasons. I made this video for people who've been asking to see my latest hobby, which are running guns. I also made this video because I believe playing outside is good for our health. Currently, two out of five Americans is dealing with some form of mental health. So I hope this video will encourage you to find and try new ways to go play outside and stay healthy. On that note, if you're in need of serious professional help for depression, suicidal thoughts, or any other type of mental health issue, I encourage you to reach out to someone you trust immediately or uh, contact the National Crisis Lifeline by dialing 988. Uh, the sooner you reach out, the sooner you can get healthy and will get healthy. Um, but you got to take the first step. Okay, so those are the reasons I made the video. Second, I had some issues with this video. Um, halfway through the event, my GoPro died. And the additional footage I shot with my phone was unusable due to excessive wind noise that I could not edit out, no matter how I tried. But I pieced together what I have, and I think it'll give you a good taste of what running guns are like. Um, finally, what's on this video? Uh, today you'll be watching my first running gun from Pawnee, Oklahoma, uh, last summer, July 2021. You'll hear my pre-race thoughts, see live footage from the race, hear post-race interviews with other racers, and hear my final thoughts on my first running gun. Um, if you're interested in trying a running gun, uh, drop a comment below and I'll send you some info on races in your area. That's it. I hope you liked the video. It would mean a lot to me if you'd leave your honest feedback in the comments. What's up, people? It's time to go play outside. Today we're headed to the Pawnee Running Gun or the Oklahoma Running Gun. Pawnee, Oklahoma. It's uh, July 2021. Luckily I've got some cloud, some overcast. Shouldn't be too hot. But uh, if you don't know what a running gun is, uh, guys, it's kind of like a biathlon. I got to run four miles and uh, there'll be about six to eight shooting stages. Handgun rounds uh, up to 50 yards up to 40 shots and rifle rounds up to 500 yards uh, 60 shots so we can carry about 25 pounds of gear they put these on to simulate what it would be like to be a minute man and have to grab your gear and go to war I have an idea in my head what I think I would be that would be like but I'm a total noob so honestly have no idea what I'm doing. I, my buddy Mike helped me zero in my rifle two weeks ago. Other than that, I've never shot it. And uh, we also learned the sights on my handgun are off. But maybe with a little luck, I can uh, finish the run and finish some of the handgun stages. Uh, my only goals today, I got three goals. One is to be safe, since I'll be running with loaded weapon. Uh, two, is to learn something that's going to happen automatically and three is to have fun so let's see what happens thanks for the ride brother. Right, man. have a good one good luck that ride, <laughs> thanks i need it should be good but just listen to where they're saying i mean they'll have like different targets sometimes they'll want you shoot in certain orders at times so just pay attention to what they're saying you should be solid really and it's exactly the oh, wait. five seconds you're out, partner. Good luck. Thanks, man.
pistol only. Okay. Keep the pistol in the holster until we get down to the firing line. Okay. You can see a dueling tree there with four plates. You knock them to one side and then back to the other. Okay. So eight hits total. Okay. All right. Roger. That's it. Okay. Ready? Yes, sir. All right, shooter ready? Yes, sir. Go. All right, two four. They go the wrong way? Yeah, the car doesn't work. Oh. Oh, shit. You alright? Yeah, thanks, bro. Sorry. Sorry. Anyway. Oh, you're good. I'm about to slip like crazy in these shoes. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Can you dig it out of that for me? Yeah, I got you. Alright, I'm gonna do the course fire over here. Okay. So you're gonna see two targets. One's about 300, the other's about 500. Holy crap, okay. Got them? Yeah. Okay, on the go, on the timer, you're gonna drop into whatever position you want. Then give me one hit on the near, one far, one near, one far. Okay. Total of four hits. Okay. You're gonna have one minute. Okay. Um, and Aaron's gonna call your hits for you. Okay. All right. Any questions? Go make ready. That's the wrong one. All right. Shooter ready. And go.
Thank you, ma'am. We're going to have you come out over here. Okay. And you're going to go up to the road and then take a left. Okay. Thank you. just unloaded all my mags. I took 45 uh, pistol rounds and only used 24. I took 90 rifle rounds and only used 54, which is more than I thought. So uh, there was way less shooting than I thought, but it was a lot of fun. I mean, I'm not, I'm not disappointed at all. I learned everything I needed to learn. That's good. Whatever it was. Uh, there's that one dude that was there at the creek with us that was all in the I army like stuff. Yeah, yep. yep. He was like, I'm just, he was just hanging out on the side of that hill for like 10 minutes. He was like, <laughs> like y'all go ahead. He was like, I might fall down this thing. You yeah. know? He was like, this is my second time. I was like, geez, dude. Dude, that was tough. Yeah. That was, especially when we started going up that, that last hill right up there. Oh, gosh, dude. That one really got me. I was trying to crawl through that thing up there and I had a too big of a pack. Oh, I saw you got snug on the bob wire yeah. and, kind of, and you came out? Yeah. Yeah, I'll know next time I've got enough care beat that back. I used to do cross country like 20 years ago. <laughs> oh, yeah. So I'm like, all right, pace yourself. What do you say? Yeah, we just do the cooking. Yeah, we, we come cook for Al. <laughs> well, it smells good. I'm going to go see if it tastes good. Thank you, guys. It's not any good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're, they're loaded up in there. Did you finish that 400 yard stage? Bro, I really wish I wouldn't have passed you so I could have watched you do that. I cheated, I had a scope. All right, we just finished the 2021 summer Pawnee running gun. Holy crap, that was hard. I thought I would pace myself jog four miles no big deal it was hot I walked probably 30 40 percent of that course even though I paced myself really well there was 24 targets that had to be hit one time each it took me 78 shots and uh, three of them I didn't hit I DNF that stage I learned a lot. It was uh, very fun. Very fun. It was good times, man. I think my big takeaways are I need to learn to shoot with a rifle uh, while it's still, while I've still got the sling across me. I was taking my rifle completely off every time, which wastes time. I need a little more practice with my handgun. I didn't do very good. There was 12 handgun targets and I used 24 bullets. So I missed half the time. Uh, that's those shots weren't hard, so that was weird. I didn't expect that, but I did really well at rifle, way better than I thought. Hit a couple of 200 yard targets, which I didn't expect with iron sights. Definitely need water, definitely need to train some more, definitely need an optic 
shooting with iron sights. I mean, it's doable, but it's tough. I couldn't hit the 425 yard shot. The furthest I could go was 200. It was good, man. The land was beautiful. The course was beautiful. The, uh, the little shooting stations were really cool, the way they had them set up. I had to crawl under bob wire sometimes and walk through rivers. And some stages required you to use rifle and then pistol or pistol and then rifle. Uh, it was really cool. A lot of fun, super great people, super beautiful place. Got a t-shirt, got to eat some amazing barbecue and boudin. Smoked boudin, I've never had that. So good. I ate too much. So yeah, it was great. It was a good day. Um, really happy. It was a good day. Go play outside. I'm like, all right, pace yourself. <laughs>